Details for us. How's it looking, Em? Uh, we've got some sunshine this afternoon, Natalie, so not too bad. We have seen some showers this morning, had a few heavy downpours for parts of the southwest. The showers are clearing for a time, so there'll be some dry and some bright weather for us this afternoon, but it's already starting to feel a little bit cooler and it's cooling down even further over the weekend. Here's a trough line that brought the showers moving away to the east. This area of low pressure is going to fill in and merge with this developing low across mainland Europe, and that's what's allowing an easterly flow of air to develop and some much colder air heading our way by the end of the weekend. Back to today though you can see on the radar those heavy showers which will continue to make their way eastwards so some dry and some bright weather for a time this afternoon just perhaps still one or two showers close to the Channel Islands highs of nine or ten degrees. Now tonight a few showers will return and temperatures are going to drop below freezing so there's a Met Office warning out from midnight into tomorrow morning with the risk of some ice developing so these showers uh, will be quite localized overnight there'll be some dry and clear weather as well but it will turn cold loads of minus one so some frost and maybe some mist patches for tomorrow morning too. There'll be some sunshine around for Saturday, but also some cloud and further showers develop tomorrow afternoon, mainly falling as rain. They could be a little bit wintry if they uh, get to higher ground of the moors, highs of seven or eight degrees. These temperatures really drop though, Sunday into Monday. It looks mainly dry to start with, but the chance of a few wintry flurries. Nat.